Welcome back, girlfriend. Welcome back. Welcome back, Robin. Robin, I love you. God bless you. Welcome back. Welcome back, Robin. Hello to our online fans. I'm Diana Perez. And I'm Rob Nelson with the top stories on this Friday, February 8th. An intense manhunt is now underway in the mountains near Los Angeles for a triple murder suspect. Police are going door to door in the Big Bear Lake area looking for Christopher Dorner. They say he's already killed three people, including a police officer and the daughter of a former police captain. Dorner is a former LAPD officer. Investigators say the shootings are in retaliation for his firing back in 2008. And our other big story this morning, a monster winter storm is headed toward the northeast. It's expected to bring hurricane force winds and up to two feet of snow. Schools and workplaces are already shutting down. As many as 23 million people are in the path of this storm. In some areas, the snowfall could be the worst in a century. Boeing has been given the OK to run test flights on its 787 Dreamliner. Even though one jet flew from Texas to Washington State just yesterday, the entire fleet of 787 passenger planes remains grounded. The upcoming flights will be used to test the plane's lithium ion batteries. The jets were taken out of service when one battery caused a fire and another smoldered during a flight. And in a small Texas school district, there are a lot of double takes going on this semester. That's because there are 14 sets of twins roaming the halls. The twins are not all identical, but those who are shared stories of switching places. Some of the kids say their parents are urging them to dress differently to make it less confusing for their teachers. And you can get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Diana Perez. To all of our viewers in the Northeast, be careful out there this weekend. Stay warm, stay safe, and thanks for watching. Have a good weekend. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. The massive blizzard set to hit the eastern seaboard turned to the GMA Extreme Weather Team for storm tracking, travel advisories, and who's getting what when. Plus, manhunt, the search for an ex-cop accused of double homicide on Good Morning America. See you first thing in the morning on ABC.